Good morning, Donaldsville Arrows. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today, today is a new day. I am the best student I can be. I do my best schoolwork. I respect others. I play fairly. I am proud of all I do and say. Today's lunch will be Bosco sticks or na beef nachos. Tomorrow's breakfast will be pancake on a stick. Now to the word of the week with Katie. The word of the week is sportsmanship. It means the ability to take winning and losing without gloating or complaining. Showing good sportsmanship. When it comes to losing, it is okay to feel disappointed, but it's all right. But it's all about controlling your reaction and not losing your cool. Try using it today. Now to the thought of the day with Troy. The thought of the day is some people dream of su success while others wake up and work hard for it. Next to Brendan with today's weather. Today's weather will be rainy rainy today with a high of 62, low of 40. Now to today's birthdays and upcoming events with Aniston. Today's birthdays and upcoming events are there are no birthdays today. Now to today's trivia. Yesterday's trivia question was, in which country would you find the Eiffel Tower? The answer is France. Classes with the correct answer were... Congratulations. Today's trivia question is, which is heavier, s silver or gold? Place your answers in the trivia box outside the library. Good luck. Learn something new today and have a great day. Good morning, staff and students. Um, today, I would like to announce the winning classrooms for our popcorn party for Dojo Points. Because the librarian, Mrs. McKasick, Mrs. Castle, Mrs. Enlo, we have Mrs. Skinner, Mrs. Corbin, Miss Tammy in the cafeteria we have been keeping track of points and they give me points with your names on it for your classroom. So these are classroom points. I give points in the hall if I see good class or good hallway behavior. So for the first quarter, and I told you this was going to happen, we we're going to have a winner for the first quarter. And I'm going to start with second grade. And I will show you my sheet with all the dojo points on it for each classroom. All right, I'm not going to read through all these, but I'm going to tell you about first and second place. I decided that because Donald's feels so awesome, we will do a popcorn party for the first place classroom and the second place classroom. So the teachers, second and third grade teachers, if your class gets first or second place, you're going to see me and we'll come up with a date that we can have your popcorn party, okay? So students, remember we started over yesterday, so I already have dojo points on my desk from Mrs. McKasick in the library for classrooms who are doing a great job. So second grade, in second place with 45 points was... Mrs. Kottmeyer's class, second place, 45 points. Mrs. Kottmeyer's class, congratulations. You did a great job. And in first place, with 60 points for the first quarter, Mrs. Wright's classroom. So Mrs. Wright's classroom, excellent work. Mrs. Kottmeyer's classroom, excellent work. We are going to have a popcorn party for you just for being awesome and working hard in all those other areas, not just your classroom, but all the other areas, our common areas, the bathrooms, the hallway, those kinds of things. So we did the same thing for third grade, and we have a second place winner, and they will be receiving a popcorn party, and the second place winner for third grade is... Mr. Fox's class. Mr. Fox's class had 55 points the first quarter uh, as a class, um, and they came in second place. In first place, will also, of course, receive a popcorn party, and that is Mrs. Meyer's class. So excellent job, Mrs. Meyer's class. You guys had 62 points. Mr. Fox's class had 55 points. And so please make sure you're still working on things like problem of the week or math problem of the week. One of the reasons these people... One is because they were consistently turning in problem of the week for math, and that will help get you points as well. So excellent job. We are proud of all of our classes, but we're especially proud of Fox and Myers and Kottmeyer and Wright because they had the top scores for the building, and they will be having a party.
So teachers, please let me know when that party is going to happen, uh, and I will get that popcorn made. Excellent job, guys. Keep it up. Keep doing a great job this week as well. Have a good one.